Here's your WNEM TV5 news update. Good afternoon, everyone. I'm Frank Turner. Here's a look at the top stories we're following for you today. The attorney for flood victims handling the prolonged litigation against Boyce entities in the state of Michigan, calling on state officials to expedite the litigation process, bringing closure to those people. It's been a year since the catastrophic flood sweeping through portions of mid-Michigan. Right now, the case against the state of Michigan is in the court of claims. It won't go to trial until 2024. Attorney Van Johnson says that's not soon enough for people still rebuilding their homes and lives. Stars installing new ultraviolet light air cleaning units on buses. The technology kills viruses, including COVID-19. Stars will remove the vinyl barriers between seats to ensure the best effectiveness of the tool. AT&T reaching a deal to combine Warner Media Division with Discovery Communications. Under the deal, the two companies will be spun off into a standalone media company. AT&T receiving $43 billion and 71% of the new company's shares. Warner Media contains well-known entities like CNN, HBO, the Warner Brothers Studio, and the streaming service HBO Max. Discovery has streaming platform Discovery Plus and channels including Animal Planet and TLC. The deal is still subject to regulatory approval. Now here's John with your forecast. Thank you very much, Frank. Let's go over your forecast as we're going throughout a Monday, looking and feeling more like summer, especially as we get later on into the week. But let's enjoy some sunshine while we have it. For our southern counties, we're talking low to mid 70s, a little cooler near the lake shore in the thumb, but a good mix of the six and seven, 60s and 70s with partly to mostly sunny skies. Mid 70s for most in the Tri Cities, our western counties will get some more sun the further north you go. Similar numbers into the low to mid 70s for most and near the lake shore again a little cooler in the 60s along the immediate lake shore uh, the further inland you go still some more sun with numbers again into the 70s tonight it's down into the lower 50s you got clear to partly cloudy skies with a light breeze out of the south but we'll continue with the warming trend throughout the week we've got upper 70s by tuesday and wednesday and then making a run near the 80s with some more humidity in the forecast as we're getting closer and closer to the weekend there you go seven day forecast it's dry today you've got a few more clouds tomorrow, possibly some late evening showers. Better chances come on Wednesday for the rain shower activity at 79. Then it's 80s, mid 80s as we go late week into the weekend. A few pop up chances for some showers and thunderstorms with the warm and humid air maze mass that we're going to have in play. In the first one five weather center, I'm meteorologist John Gross. Remember to tune into WNEM TV 5 on air and online 24 7 for the latest news, weather and information.